Hi everyone, my name is Zoe Williams and I'm the Youth Services Librarian here at University Park Public Library. I want to welcome you to Virtual Baby Story Shorts. This is a 10 to 15 minute time for us to share books and songs together and for me to model for you what it looks like to share stories and songs with your child. And all of this is to help them get ready to read and learn all those early literacy skills that are so important for reading. So we'll get started with our welcome song. It's called Welcome, Welcome Everyone, and you can clap along with me. Welcome, welcome everyone. Now we're here, let's have some fun. First we'll clap our hands to sew, then we'll bend and touch our toes. Can you reach for your toes? Welcome, welcome everyone. Now we're here, let's have some fun. This next song, I put the words up here. And this is a great one for naming the parts of our body, which are some of the first words that your baby learns to say. So as we name the parts, you can move them around, point to them, all of those things to help your child learn the words and the meanings connect to each other. Where is big toe? Where is big toe? There he is, there he is. Wiggle waggle big toe, wiggle waggle big toe, my big toe, my big toe. Where is elbow, where is elbow, there he is, there he is. Bindi bindi elbow, bindi bindi elbow, my elbow, my elbow. Where are two hands? Where are two hands? Here they are, here they are. Clappy, clappy two hands, clappy, happy two hands. My two hands, my two hands. Where is Tommy? Where is Tommy? There he is, there he is. Squishy, squashy tummy, squishy, squashy tummy, my tummy my tummy. This next song, I don't have the words up on the wall for us, but you can lift your child up and down and back and forth as we sing. It's called the elevator song. Oh, the city is great and the city is grand. There's a whole lot of people on a little bit of land and we live way up high on the 57th floor. And this is what we do when we go out the door. Everyone ready? We take the elevator up, we take the elevator down. We take the elevator up, we take the elevator down. We take the elevator up, take the elevator down. And we turn around. Let's do that one more time. We take the elevator up, we take the elevator down. We take the elevator up, we take the elevator down. Take the elevator up, we take the elevator down. We turn around. All right, now it's time for our story. Today I am reading Fa La La, written and illustrated by Leslie Patricelli and published by Candlewick Press. It's almost Christmas. I love Christmas. We go to pick a tree. This one? This one. We put on the lights. Look at me, I'm a Christmas tree. We decorate a gingerbread house. Boom. I make presents. A necklace for mommy, a telescope for daddy, a toy for kitty, and a collar for doggy. Time to see Santa. One, two, three, swing. I have to be so patient. Ooh, someone is yawning. My turn. Poke. Ouch. 
Mama? It's okay, baby. Ho, ho, ho. Say cheese. We sing Christmas songs. Fa la 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 la. We sing Christmas songs. Fa la 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 la. Time for bed. Shh. Will Santa come? It's morning! Yay! Chugga, 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 choo, choo. We open and open and open and open. Looks like everyone loves their presents, doesn't it? I love Christmas. Merry Christmas. I love Christmas. Merry Christmas. The end. I hope you enjoyed our story. Next, we'll do a couple of songs together. The first song is another one that's great for naming the parts of our body. So you can sing along with me using these words. Everyone ready? Here are baby's fingers. Can you wiggle those fingers? Here are baby's toes. Let's reach for those toes. Here's baby's belly button. Can you find your belly button? Round and round it goes. Let's draw a circle on our tummies. Let's do that one more time. Here are baby's fingers. Wiggle those fingers. Here are baby's toes. Let's reach for those toes. Here's baby's belly button. Round and round it goes. Is anyone ticklish? Next, I wanted to share with you one of my very favorite songs to do with babies. This is a great one for putting your child on your lap, or if you have a big kid, you can bounce up and down and lift your arms up and down with us. It's called Drive the Fire Truck. Hurry, hurry, drive the fire truck. Hurry, hurry, drive the fire truck. Hurry, hurry, drive the fire truck. Ding, 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 ding. Hurry, hurry, raise the ladder. Hurry, hurry, raise the ladder. Hurry, hurry, raise the ladder. Ding, 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 ding. Hurry, hurry, put out the fire. Hurry, hurry, put out the fire. Hurry, hurry, put out the fire. Ding, 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 ding. Hurry, hurry, drive the fire truck. Hurry, hurry, drive the fire truck. Hurry, hurry, drive the fire truck. Ding, 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 ding. I am so excited to share my Rudolph Rudolph flannel with you guys today. So we are going to practice naming our colors as we sing this song about Rudolph Rudolph. So you can sing along with me as you get a feel for the words. Rudolph Rudolph, what will you do? You can't guide Santa's sleigh if your nose is... What color is this? What color is that? Blue! Right. And you'll notice that the last word of each line rhymes with the color. So that can be a hint to listen for a rhyming word. Rudolph, Rudolph, you're such a silly fellow. Who will know you if your nose is? What's well, a color that rhymes with fellow? Yellow, yes. Yeah, Rudolph is with a yellow nose. Rudolph, Rudolph, your way cannot be seen through the wintry weather if your nose is green. It would be hard to see everything with a green light, wouldn't it? Rudolph, Rudolph, Santa gave a wink. Can everyone wink? But what will he say if your nose is, what color is this? Pink, yes, very good. Rudolph, Rudolph, it's time to fly at night. But you can't get through the snow if your nose is... This is the same color as snow. What color is snow? White, yes, 
Very good. Rudolph, Rudolph, Santa has his sack, but you're not ready if your nose is black. All right. What color is Rudolph's nose actually? Do you know what color his nose is supposed to be? Rudolph, Rudolph, the children are in bed and now we can get on our way because your nose is red. There's Rudolph with his red nose. Can you guys sing Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer with me? Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer had a very shiny nose and if you ever saw it you would even say it glows. All of the other reindeer used to laugh and call him names. They never let poor Rudolph join in any reindeer games. Then one foggy Christmas Eve, Santa came to say ho, ho, ho. Rudolph with your nose so bright, won't you guide my sleigh tonight? Then how the reindeer loved him as they shouted out with glee. Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer, you'll go down in his story. Yay! Well, everyone, thank you so much for reading and singing with me today. I hope you had a great time. And now it's time to sing our goodbye song. Our hands say thank you with the clap, clap, clap. Our feet say thank you with the tap, tap, tap. Clap, 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 tap, tap, tap. Now we roll our hands and wave goodbye. Bye, everyone. I hope to see you again next time.